In this video, I'm going to tell you about what happens when you have Jupiter in the Dhanishta Nakshatra. Okay, so if you want to take personal consultation, you can check the website. Link is in the description. So let's start. So now, Dhanishta comes in Capricorn as well as Aquarius. Okay, now you are placing Jupiter here. Jupiter is the planet that represents your luck, prosperity, wisdom, your ability to take decisions, your your education, your knowledge, your teachers, your counselors, your uh, what kind of wisdom you will gain in this life, your wisdom basically, right? Your judgment. So uh, you are placing that Jupiter in Dhanishta Nakshatra. Dhanishta Nakshatra, the symbol is a musical drum. Okay, the planet is Mars. It is ruled by eight Vasus, but the presiding deity is Shiva. Okay, Shiva prominence comes into existence in the sign of Aquarius basically because Aquarius completely is ruled by Shiva. Okay, in the Capricorn part, it is more related to Vishnu. Now, this is a Rakshas, demonic nakshatra, tamasic nakshatra, and is towards destruction. It is the meaning of this nakshatra is the richest. Someone who is the who is the luckiest, someone who who is the wealthiest. Okay, female nakshatra. This is right, and the animal symbol is a female lion, lioness. Right now, Jupiter. You are placing Jupiter here. So first, we will talk about general sense, and then we will see the difference in the Capricorn and Aquarius. Okay, first you will. love to listen music with jupiter here uh, you can love to listen old music different kind of music right retrograde rules outcast okay so that's why if it is retrograde you can love to listen the type of music which people don't generally listen in your community like if you are indian you can love to listen russian music turkish music so that kind of difference can be here you will be goal oriented person right and you will be quick with it with it okay you will understand things easily and you will have very much analytical mind with jupiter here you will be definitely intelligent and clever as well but we know that jupiter is a planet of wisdom so wherever it goes it brings wisdom okay Dhanishta is a very goal-oriented nakshatra. It wants to achieve something, and whatever it wants to achieve should be the best. Okay, so when Jupiter is here, first of all, it gives you guidance to go in the proper direction, to take proper decision. Okay, to not not to rush towards the things, to not be in the hurry. Okay, so Jupiter will give its wisdom to this nakshatra. right so you will be goal oriented but you will see other aspects as well right you will analyze how you need to achieve your goals and definitely uh, with jupiter here which is the most auspicious planet you will try not to go towards the wrong direction especially if it's not retrograde if it is a uh, direct then jupiter will definitely give its good qualities in a smooth manner it doesn't mean that if it's retrograde it will not give good qualities uh, it will give but ups and downs will be there retrograde basically means that you will learn from your mistakes okay so jupiter in the mars nakshatra definitely you can have anger issues very straight forward you can be okay and uh, whatever you want to achieve you just want to achieve uh with the capricorn aspect you can be very much stubborn as well it also makes you practical okay and you may want to achieve name and fame right and definitely you can achieve because with jupiter here it's giving you knowledge so definitely you, you will gain respect and fame because of your knowledge people will come to uh, take advice from you and you can give practical advice uh, but as a teacher okay as a teacher you can become very strict you can become very strict like follow the rules follow the rules and regulations follow the law okay believe in hard work these things will be there okay you will utilize your knowledge and skills to its best you will not easily give up okay with females they can be more towards masculine side 
ओके लाइक बोल्ड डेयरिंग एनर्जेटिक ओके समटाइम्स यू कैन बी रूड एंड हार्श एज वेल इफ यू बिकम अ टीचर यू विल बी अ स्ट्रिक्ट टीचर ओके एंड यू विल वॉन्ट योर स्टूडेंट्स टू बी इन डिसिप्लिन डिसिप्लिन कैन बी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर यू हेयर राइट इट विल बी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड यू विल नेवर गो अगेंस्ट योर एथिक्स एंड प्रिंसिपल्स सो लिटल विथ स्टबर्न एनर्जी स्पेशली विथ कैप्रिकॉन दे कैन बिकम लिटल विथ स्टबर्न यू कैन बिकम अ वेरी गुड लॉयर बिकॉज यू ऑलवेज सपोर्ट ट्रूथ यू ऑलवेज सपोर्ट राइट यूर्स थिंग्स यू आर राइट यूर्स एंड वॉन्ट टू वर्क ऑन द राइट पाथ बट इफ इट इज रेट्रोग्रेड रेट्रोग्रेड मीन्स गोइंग टू द डिफरेंट डिरेक्शन सो you will become clever like uh, you will walk on the righteous path but you will also become clever means that you will not make yourself lose anything okay clever means what the people who are clever uh, they make the things done without losing something okay so that kind of energy can be here you will deal with every situation very wisely okay and you will be very matured person with jupiter here you can be matured you will be expert into the things whatever you do right see in the capricorn part it will not be too much much to words spirituality you will be hard working goal oriented and career oriented person who will want to achieve something in your career if you are looking for your spouse the characteristics that i am telling to you will be present in your spouse okay you will become a very good leader a practical leader ओके विथ जुपिटर हियर यू विल बी हम्बल ऑल्सो राइट हम्बल पर्सनैलिटी काइंड पर्सनैलिटी गिविंग पर्सनैलिटी डाउन टू अर्थ पर्सनैलिटी बिकॉज जुपिटर जुपिटर इज अ गुरु अ टीचर सैटन सैटन इज अ लोली प्लानट ओके विच रिप्रेजेंट्स द लो क्लास पीपल ओके सो यू विल बी अटैच टू देम एंड यू विल ट्रीट एवरी वन इक्वली and you will never like to discriminate between anyone you will be the one who supports the righteous things okay you will be a natural leader and people can rely on you you will have motherly qualities also you will be responsible also you are going to be very responsible it is also possible that uh, you have to take your family responsibilities okay you will be emotional from inside but you will also focus on the practical side right you will see the greater cause okay you will see the bigger picture so you will try to stay practical okay you will not become very much emotional okay or you will not let your emotions overpower you you will always try to become practical okay you will definitely want to have wealth and success with this placement now if you have this placement in capricorn side so you will be towards uh, practicality it can also make you a little bit narrow minded okay uh, not much risk taker strict and keep yourself reserved okay and uh, you will be very much goal oriented also and uh, you will take decisions wisely maturely okay and definitely you will be very much passionate passionate energy is going to um, be in you and uh, you will be optimistic also all these things will be there okay but you will be more towards materialistic side of life right materialistic aspect but if this happens to be in aquarius sign then that narrow mindedness will decrease okay you will become more understanding more accommodating your uh, emotional side will get balanced because in the capricorn part they try to suppress their emotions okay and a little bit stubborn energy is there because because capricorn is a earth sign okay so all the earthly aspect finance money and all the materialistic aspects you will more towards that materialistic aspects of life earthly person hard working have to work hard have to achieve something these things will be there okay but but in the aquarius part okay in the aquarius part you you are going to become divine and spiritual and uh, you will uh, see the bigger picture and uh, you will become broad minded okay and you, you can become more expressive and uh, you will want to enjoy the life your wisdom will increase right you will not suppress your emotions or suppress the things 
instead you will try to experience and learn the new new things okay you will want to learn many many different things okay uh, so this thing will happen you will become more pure your nature will improve and light-hearted you will become your friend circle will increase and here basically what it means um, in the capricorn side you may have to learn okay it is about learning aspect but in the aquarius side it is about teaching well you are not learning anymore but you are teaching the people guiding the people telling the people what they need to do okay and uh, you are dealing with the masses so in capricorn basically uh, when you experience the materialistic aspects of life this is a nakshatra which represents someone who is all rounder because it is ruled by eight vasus and the qualities will become more significant uh, when it comes to the sign of aquarius okay uh, in capricorn also it's very good but in aquarius it also very good okay so that is the thing and i hope this video was helpful thank you bye